I'm gonna try to get this on uh, film here. This is the elusive kangaroo. Kangaroo mouse. See his little, his long like, uh, see his long tail? It's got like a poof on the end. It's kind of hard to see. But I got him right there. He only comes out at night and he's they're really hard to catch on film. He's kind of hiding behind the propane tank. And you can see the end of his fluffy tail here. They kind of hop up and down and they actually have a little pouch. Let's see if I can get him to come this way. He's scared, of course. There you are. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> Let's see. We can find him. He's hiding under the grill. Uh, yep, there's his tail. <laughs> Let's see. Uh. Hey, don't move. Yeah, really good at hiding. There's his poofy tail. See that long tail? I just want to take your picture. There you are. Now come say hi. Anyway, it's like a special rodent because of that tail it's got, see? There you go. And they hop. They actually don't uh, uh, grow. I'm trying to do this with one hand. There we go. That's a good shot. Hi. Yeah. See him hop? <laughs> but see his big feet? It's just like a kangaroo. And the tail, the characteristic poofy tail there. Almost got all of you. I'm just just doing some videography here. And, uh, anyway, it has a pouch. And actually, all the if under the grill is all sorts of like junk that blows in because it's a corner here. And the little like little seeds from trees grow blow under the grill and they get trapped. So this is why he comes around, he goes under the grill and all that. It looks like dust to you and me, but it's actually little seeds that he puts in his cheeks, like some uh, Japanese anime character or something. And then uh, stuffs it in his cheeks and then like spits it back out. Uh, once he gets down in his hole, see all that junk? Let's see if we, yeah, do your thing. Yeah, see? See, I'm friendly. Let's see. Let's see. Yeah. Let's see if we can get him, if we can get him eating. Stuff in his cheeks. You gonna stuff your cheeks? <laughs> He's thinking about it. <laughs> see? Yeah. You're thinking about it. He's thinking about it. So he's thinking if he's getting used to me or not. But, uh, anyway. Go ahead and eat the stuff. There we go. See? Go ahead. I forgot. These things can hear. I'm used to lizards, so I gotta, maybe, maybe I should, I'm used to lizards that can't hear.
<laughs> anyway, I'm excited because uh, it's very it's very hard to get them. I've never got this close to one ever because they only come out right when it turns dark. They're never out in the middle of the night. They're never out past like two hours after dark. It, the sun just went down. They're only active dusk and dawn, basically. So he's probably not going to do anything, but I was trying to catch him uh, eating some of this stuff because that's what I know he wants to do. And uh, I think I'm just going to let him. He wants to run away, but he wants his food. <laughs> <laughs> Which way are you going to go? <laughs> I was trying to catch him. See him hop? That's the other thing I wanted to do. Catch him hop. There he goes. There he goes. Right there. Let's see if we can catch him hop. Hop, hop, hop. <laughs> hop, 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 hop. Hop, 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 hop. Come on, show me how you hop. Show me how you hop. Hop, hop, hop. So I'm not trying to torture. I'm just trying to document how it hops. Whoop. How it actually hops at you. Or hops around. Hop. And again, that large uh, poofy tail. There it goes. So I think that's good documentation of that it's an actual kangaroo mouse that uh, we're looking at here. All right, I'll let him eat the uh, stuff under the grill.